Hello there, this is Peter from ultrajourneys.org. In this video I will teach you how to make your own minimalistic running sandal, very cheap, also used by the uh, tribe, running tribes in South America. It will allow, allow you to run in a much more natural position and once you get used to this you will never get back to running shoes. So let's take a look. Uh, to start you will need a rubber mat which you can pick up in many hardware shops. Something like uh, 5 to 6 mm thickness, not too soft, not too hard as uh, it will protect you from uh, rocks and glasses, whatever you meet along your run. So you buy a running mat, a square one, and then basically you will use a pen or a pencil to mark the perimeter of your uh, foot. You leave a little extra space on all the sides as you will have to uh, attach a small rope to keep the... Uh, sole attached to your feet while running. Once you do this, you uh, basically um, cut along the marked uh, running foot shape and you'll have uh, your, the outline of your, both your right and your left foot. After this, you place your foot again on the uh, cut piece of mat and you will mark three points where you'll attach the uh, sole to your feet. One is beneath the two big fingers over here. One on the... Uh, left side of the foot and one on the right side of the foot approximately in this location so once marked again you can use a small knife to uh, make those three holes i've already done it here to save a little bit of time here here and here you can also use a hammer and a tool to cut a perfect round shape once this is done your sole is ready uh, the next thing is you will uh, have to buy a paracord, which is basically a strong rope. This has to be a little bit strong as we'll, uh, you'll be running on top of the rope, so it should not easily break. Uh, paracord has uh, some internal strings that will uh, give it a good lifetime. So initially what you do is you start with the upper hole here. You use the knife to squeeze in the paracord through the front of the rubber sole. Take it out from the base and here you will start attaching it. So you make a small uh, knot at this location so that once you pull the rope back from the top, it will uh, stay in place. Next, basically, you're gonna go to the inner side of the uh, sandal. So you again use the knife to squeeze the rope uh, from the top to the base. There we go. You take it through with your hands. There you go. You leave a little bit of rope here because your foot will have to fit inside and you take the rope inside the other rope. Then the paracord will go around your heel and go finally through this uh, third and final hole. Here you go, squeeze it through. And again, there you go, you leave some space for the ankle. Take it again inside and that's it. Finally, you will have to attach the rope uh, to the initial string and you will have a proper uh, place to put your foot inside. So basically after doing this, you place your foot inside uh, uh, the sole here and you will start adjusting. So let me just loose, loosen up a little bit and now I adjust the rope so that it perfectly fits. There we go. All right. so the front portion, you just make sure that it's not too tight, not too loose. Then around the uh, heel again, you tighten up just enough. And then again, you string it to the front of the uh, the front rope. Any extra rope, you can just uh, keep it with a second knot. You take a little extra, sometimes this part might break and then you will have to make a new knot. Cut it, make a new knot, so you'll need a little bit of extra rope. Voila, here you have it, your new 50 rupee uh, running sandal which will allow you to run in a very comfortable, natural position. Have fun and if you have any questions or doubts, don't hesitate to contact me on ultrajourneys.org.